GSG presents Whiting Wednesday. I'm Mark Sudonik, Textile Application Specialist at Graphic Solutions Group. Today in our Applications Lab, we're going to do a specialty print using two different Aviant Infinite Effects specialty bases. We're going to start with Infinite Effects Cork Base and Infinite Effects Suede Base. We mix the cork base and the suede base together at a 50% ratio, so 50% of each base, and we added 5% of sienna brown into that ink mixture. For this specialty print, we're gonna use a 110 mesh screen, and we've coated this with Ulano QXO emulsion, and we did a uh, one over two pass with the emulsion. So we have a, not a thick stencil, but we have a really nice ink well underneath it. We're gonna use a 60 durometer squeegee. We have about a 12, to 10 degree angle on this squeegee. We're gonna print at a moderately fast print speed and we're gonna run this to about 20 PSI and we're gonna do a double stroke. We're gonna flash it and we'll do a double stroke again and it's off to the dryer. Now keep in mind when you're flashing any specialty base that has a blowing agent or you know a, a puff look to it, you only wanna bring that ink up to the gel temperature. You don't wanna introduce so much heat that that ink actually starts to expand because we're gonna be putting another color on top of it. So we're flashing this at 280 degrees and for just right about three and a half to four seconds. As you can see here, after the flash, our ink is just gelled, it's just dry to the touch and it has not started to expand at all. So it's perfect condition to go ahead and put our top color on. Now that we're out of the dryer, here's our finished shirt. We have a really nice one color, showing some 3D dimension to it, some really nice depth. And with the combination of the Avian Infinite Effects cork base and suede base, we have a very soft print. Even though it's thick, it's not very heavy, it's very easy to wear. Here in our applications lab, we're working on techniques like this constantly to help you grow your business. For more tips and information on screen printing, visit gogsg.com, Follow us on social media and we'll see you next time.